everybody welcome to my channel i hope that you are doing well today today i've got a sunflower painting that turned out rather fun so i'm putting down here i think i used my karen dash um, watercolor crayons you could use any form of watercolor um, for under the base of this soft pastel drawing i'm trying out some new soft pastels they are from color block and i can leave the link below it's good to have a variety of hardness to softness um, when you're painting with soft pastels because if they're all super soft it's really hard to get the layers but doing the uh, watercolor uh, sort of underpainting it helps get a lot of color blocked in getting your values and then um, then you don't have to use as many soft pastels to layer on top so it saves a few layers of pasteling <laughs> if you would um, and so I'm going in and just kind of establishing my table and my background and getting the dark color behind there so that when you put the flowers on you kind of always have to think of with painting going from the back to the front um, if that makes any sense um, otherwise not that you have to but <laughs> it certainly helps with getting those background colors going and, and makes background easier so I'm just trying to layer in some colors getting some red pops of colors there to sort of reflect what's going on in the um, middle of the flowers and I like to whenever I use a color in one place I do like to tie it in somewhere else so good place to do that in this situation is the vase and then you can kind of get little bits of color here and there and on the table and I liked how this turned out they're warm colors but it seemed homey and inviting and um, this is a five by seven I believe I think it's five by seven um, that uh, I'll probably eventually be selling in my shop um, I, I'll need to uh, spray it and all of that good stuff just to seal it a little bit and um, yeah I really liked how it turned out so I wanted to look at it for a while I really like it it's um, it, these were great pastels um, probably not like on the top of my favorite list of like if I had to choose only one brand but uh, but they were great they have and they're square so you can use the little points to do some drawing um, you know with the um, edges there take this opportunity if you would to give a like and subscribe to this channel if you enjoy cooking and art and paper crafting thanks so much and I hope that you have a creative day get yourself in there and make something today it's really great for our brains thanks guys see you in the next video